look back on that war in sadness, mourning for the people who died, and, and pride and astonishment, really, in what they achieved. And we'll be hearing from people who are marching today. Let's join Dan Snow again. He's with the 100-year-old veteran, Ernie Searling. Yes, Ernie, back by popular demand this year. Thanks for joining us again. What are you, what are you thinking about this year during this march? Oh, it's a, it's a march, and uh, everybody seems to be quite happy and <laughs> pushing more around. <laughs> and it's good to see so many people. You were telling me just earlier that when you joined up at the grand old age of 22, there were you were serving alongside veterans of the First World War. Yes. yes. What do you remember about them? Mostly they wanted to cheat off of us because... <laughs> because it was a gas course at Tipna on the, on the, on the Isle of Wight, and they, they wanted us there. But when we went into the room, the, the old soldiers saw us younger Marines, and they, they settled in beside us so that they could get, get, get the answers from us. <laughs> I don't know how the examiners found it. They must have thought, it's a strange sort of paper. <laughs> they were a bit rusty, some of those World War I veterans. So, and wh then you went to serve in the Indian Ocean, did you? Yes, yes. I, I'd been in the Indian Ocean before, but this time we were going back again to Sri Lanka. It was known as Ceylon when I went there first time, but uh, this time it was Sri Lanka. And uh, I, I like the Sinhalese people. And they were very, very kind to us chaps. And they always made us, made themselves very friendly with us. And it was a joy to be with them. People used to say, oh, they're black. I said, I don't mind what colour they are. I said, they're gentlemen and they're ladies and they're lovely. And I was rather pleased because my, my cousin was an archdeacon of Jaffna. And uh, he knew all about them, and, and they, they know about him, so <laughs> it was a small world. Well, Ernie, thank you. It's been a great privilege for us to have you here today, and we'll see you next year. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs>